Hello again there dear YouTube, dear lovely viewer. Today we're going to be looking at this, which is the Dell Optiplex 3040. As you can see, I'll try not to move the camera around. Now, what's incredible about this is it's an i5 PC running 4 gig of RAM. And it was designed to fulfill the market for desktop PCs, but for a smaller form factor. And believe you me, this has got quite a lot of technology in it. Let's start with what we can see at the front, which is the two USB ports on these. These are high speed USB ports, which are here and here. Then of course, you've got a microphone and an audio jack, just like what you would find on most PCs these days. Now, we spin this round at the back. Here we have wireless antenna. It supports Ethernet. We have a further two slower speed USB ports and two higher speed at the back, giving us a total of six USBs. Then, of course, what we also have is our HDMI input and output. And, of course, this one here is the power jack and the case screw here to open the unit. Now, I picked this up for all of £95, which is a pretty good deal, I must admit. However, this has only got 4 gig of RAM in it, so we're going to take this in just a moment to uh, 12 gig, because I have a stick of 8, which is right here. So what we're going to do is we're just going to quickly go over onto the workbench and I will see you over there in just a moment. So here we are, we're on the workbench and basically put, this is our Dell Optiplex 3040. So we're going to start by removing the case screw, the single screw from the back. And then this should slide forward like so. And the case lifts off, revealing the innards, as you can see. Now, for the RAM upgrade, we have two spring plastic clips here, which we're going to pull in, well, push in rather removing the fan assembly and we'll just set that off to one side like that. Now as you can see we have a spare RAM slot so what we'll do is we'll just install that so it's a nice quick and easy video this one because that is essentially upgraded. In another video, what we will do is show you it running. And then, of course, just putting that back on is a cinch. Now, if I wanted to upgrade the hard drive, which I will do probably in another video, the same procedures apply. You push these two lugs in and slide the drive caddy out. And then, of course, we would take the drive out from here but we're not going to do that in this one so just push it back and it locks into place that's the upgrade essentially done now i can put the top back on that slides into place and the rear case screw just simply does up and this ticket can now come off because I didn't pay £109 for it. I only paid 95 for it. And then, of course, I can get that grubby sticker off of there. I'll need some cleaning fluid for that. And if we also wanted to, then what we can do 
is the Wi-Fi antenna. We can upgrade that as well. And I might very well do that at a later date. I'm going to try and now get that back on. There we are. Without cross-threading it. But there you are. That is fairly simply done. And that completes uh, the RAM upgrade, taking it from 4 gig to 12. I hope you enjoyed that, and I'll see you in the next one. So, there we are, lovely viewer. I hope you enjoyed that simple movie there, or video. And uh, that was taking the Dell Octoplex 3040 from 4 gig to now an additional 8 gig giving us a total of 12 gigabytes of store wells of random access memory. In a later video, I'm sure we will revisit this to upgrade the hard drive, taking that from 250 gigabytes to at least a terabyte or maybe more. But until the next time, dear lovely viewer, continue as always to get that bell on, continue to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.